The Chartered Institute of Taxation of Nigeria, CITN, in Jalingo and its district society has officially inaugurated its second chairman and a new set of district executives to guide the institute's activities over the next two years. The inauguration held in Jalingo was agreed was graced by the 16th national president of the institute, the chairman of the Taraba State Board of Internal Revenue, the state accountant general, and several industry leaders. Speaking at the event, the Taraba State Accountant General, Mr. Gaius Danjuma, who served as the chairman of the occasion, welcomed the national president and his team to Taraba. He praised the CITN as a professional body with a stellar reputation, expressing optimism that his expertise will greatly benefit the state. Also, the chairman of the Taraba State Board of Internal Revenue, Brigadier General Jeremiah Aliu Faransa, who served as a host, emphasized the relevance of the event's theme, highlighting its alignment with Taraba State's developmental goals through effective, through effective uh, action. The newly elected chairman, Mr. Luca Joel Maza, expressed profound gratitude to all who contributed to the success of the election and the investiture ceremony. He assured that he and his team would uphold the Institute's professional standards and fulfill the trust placed in them. The event also featured the presentation of awards to key dignitaries, including the Chairman of the Taraba State Board of Internal Revenue and the State Accountant General. CIA, <coughs> as a professional body, has made a name in the administration of taxes in Nigeria and beyond. And I want to believe with this track record of the Institute, Taraba State will not be left out. Your visit to the state happened to be at the right hand, where the captain of the state, in person of His Excellency, Dr. Abu Kepas, is in present internally around the state internally generated revenue idea. By having a visionary leader now, the governor of Taraba State, who is up and doing to ensure that uh, the over-dependence on federal allocation should be, you know, tackled in the sense that we have to get more revenue now to complement the federal allocation. And when I came on board, I think as of today, we're trying our best to ensure that uh, Taraba State uh, move forward. Um, I will advise or I will counsel the new chairman to ensure that uh, he to contribute his own effort through one by training, holding seminars and workshops. I would like to demonstrate my sincere appreciation to the members of the CIT, Jalingo and District Society for believing in my abilities and electing me for this respected position. I am encouraged by your steady support and promise to serve you to the best of my prosperity. The field of transition is constantly evolving and it is our duty to stay abreast with current trends, policies and regulations. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.